Hey guys, Spike from Two on Two, and and this WA, <laughs> and this is <laughs> nice, and this is part two of the of our Civilization Five Let's Play. Yeah, so, indeed, we are continuing. Yeah, we're continuing slowly. <laughs> Where we left progress. off, we we just found each other. Well, I found his capital. I don't think he's found mine yet. Have you? Uh, no, not yet. I can't see you, but I know roughly where you are. I'll have to go out into the sea or to the ocean to get to you. Yeah. Because, of, uh, well, just because, just because of where you are. Mm. Well, I think I can see part of your island from here. To be fair. Yours is a far more crowded continent than mine. I've got a bigger one than yours. <laughs> <laughs> I wish it wasn't so crowded. So, your uh, fans won't have actually seen my continent. Uh, yep, but <clears throat> no. it's to the left. No one wants to see your sad little eyes. <laughs> <laughs> You're just jelly. I would let you live here, but there's not much space left. Uh, not much space left. I mean, you don't see much, much space left here. Absolutely. Oh, they're crossbowmen. Getting more advanced. This is, is this good, good yeah. news. Yeah, it's good news. Good news. <laughs> <clears throat> okay, um, I completely lost where I am research-wise. Economics, I'm going for apparently. I remember what I'm going for, but all right, I'm at the south of your continent now. He doesn't even have a religion yet. <clears throat> okay, I'm gonna go for astronomy so I can get into the sea. I figure I need to get into the ocean at some point. Mm. I'd rather. Oh god, my, my mouse just. Yeah, my camera just went completely nuts. Okay. Um, I can pass through there, can't I? Come on, move. Did you just glitch out there? Uh, why? Um, because I did. Uh, my Gallius didn't move for a moment there, but it's fine. Happened, happened all the time in the light in, in our last part, so. Sorry, just give me a sec. I glitched out, so I didn't quite. We can't accept Catholicism if this. Catholicism, I should say. If it's only just now getting upgraded. <laughs> what a baby religion. No, I'm I'm not gonna vote for having a world religion because that's gonna give that's gonna give that one particular civ way too much power. Mm. For for my liking. That's just that's just too much religious power for me to win. Yeah, so. I mean, it might be something I might do later on. You never know. <laughs> but <laughs> oh, I'll I'll soon shoot you down. Yeah, I don't. That wouldn't surprise me. That's fine as well. Uh, Seventeen turns until that comes together. Yeah, well, I won't let that happen. I have the most delegations out of everybody, so I don't think anybody else wants it either. Nobody's actually Catholic, apart from uh, her. Yeah, I know what you mean. Why am I doing that? That's just stupid. Anyway, sorry. That's right. Right, I'm sorry. Make them make them way around. I'm like I'm like coming to your island very shortly. Oh, no, hold on. Oh, I can see Paris from here. Oh, I'm a little far away from that. Let's see what we got here. Hello. I found uh, your Moroccan knight. Anyway. Moroccan knight. Oh. oh. Uh, what? Yeah, at the very edge of the water, the very south. Oh yeah, near Budapest. Yeah. Uh, I, I guess you just walked past and everything because I can't see your unit. I guess you went past and didn't, you just didn't stop. <clears throat> okay, so...
France has replaced Portugal as yellow of Budapest? I don't freaking think so. Huh? Nothing. <laughs> it replaced, um, what's it called? Uh, it only replaced, um, Portugal. Uh, oh, I pressed wrong. Yeah, thing. Portugal. It's not yours. I'm not having a go at you yet. <laughs> oh, no, don't, don't you worry. Just... I'm having a go at Portugal. <clears throat> I accidentally, um, <laughs> pledged to protect Budapest by mistake. That's fine. Whatever. I'll have to, I'll have to revoke that protection soon. Because if well, something happens, I can't guarantee any... Well, actually, no, I can guarantee protection. Fuck it. Don't fuck with Budapest. I'm, I'm going to protect it as well, so I wouldn't worry. Yeah, I, you know, I've decided I can protect it. Fuck it. You fuck with Budapest, you fuck with me. And me. <laughs> I don't think anybody wants to do that, but that at the moment, so... You'll have a musket, you'll have a musket up, your, up your ass before you even knew it. <laughs> <clears throat> They want gold, do they? They fucking want gold, do they? <laughs> How British did you want to go there? Ah, uh, far enough. All right, now who's got gold? I'm starting to see all your land now. No, no, no one I've met has gold. Oh wait, hold on. Uh, no. Maybe the resource gold. <clears throat> I sent you an open borders proposition. Oh, open borders, eh? Yeah, I'll allow it. For now. Alright, well I'm making some pretty good gold at the minute. I've got a fairly reasonable fort fighting force. I mean, it's not huge and it's not tiny. Yeah. <clears throat> the, Assyrian the, the Assyrian Empire kind of does worry me a little. It's not... I wouldn't be too worried. Well, it's not... It's not their units that worry me, I mean, it's, they've still got swordsmen for crying out loud. I've got musketmen. <laughs> um, it's those siege towers that just uh, give me a little concern, <clears throat> as they would. Yeah, I get you. <laughs> I mean, they do look pretty nasty, if you ask me. Need a little bit of water there. Oh, bloody. But, um, yeah. I don't know, they, they look pretty nasty. <laughs> My army is tiny. I hope nobody invades. <laughs> <clears throat> Although, like I said, I have enough money to buy a unit every turn if I wanted to, so... Oh, I've got quite a bit of money now. I've written yeah. my, my money is really picked up. I noticed. I went. I was looking at a trade thing earlier, and I noticed you making almost as much money as me. So yeah, it's pretty it's good. A, yeah, it's a, it's a fair amount of money. Then again, I haven't said that. I got I got six trade routes open at the minute, so <clears throat> I'm about to start trading uh, some luxury resources. I've got gems, spices, cotton, citrus. You accepted our deal, did you? Yeah, cool. I can now explore your city. Yeah, go for it. Trading's been a little stiff recently. Yeah.
I don't have all the trading goods I once had, unfortunately. Although I still have <clears> a... <throat> ton of like, iron? A bunch. Well, yeah, I've got 12 iron, 20 horses. And 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 luxury resources. Can't complain with that. Wow. No, you certainly can't. Alright, I can now go into the seas. Or the ocean. Oh, you couldn't before? Ah, now you get to meet me yeah, anyway. I, I, I could go into the seas, but I couldn't go into the oceans. Yeah. Ah, okay, now we can choose what to do. Oh god, here we go. <clears throat> okay, so what do I do with this? Because I've never done this before. Alright, well, it's basically as it reads. Um, the first thing is choosing a host. This is to who can run the thing. Basically, you're deciding who gives, gets the most power. And 99% of the time, everybody just chooses themselves. And basically, the most powerful one ends up in power. Unless there's some sort of allyship where they vote for each other. Um, it's up to you who you vote for, but I'm completely voting for myself. <laughs> mm -hmm. I guess it comes round on the next turn. Maria seems to be the biggest problem for me, of Portugal. She seems annoying. <clears throat> well, you Why are all those castles around your your outskirts? Are they some oh, sort of specific uh, building for your... Those are called Casbahs. Yeah? I can't remember. Honestly, I, can't, I think I read up what they were, but I can't, don't remember what they... Ability is. Yeah. Or what they really are. Okay, so you've become the host, lucky you. Have I? No, <laughs> it's a lag day for me. I have the most delegates I, because I have so many city-state allies. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Did you vote for yourself? Yeah. That's what everybody does. <laughs> so, now we, so now we just have to wait another 12 turns, do we? I kind of voted a lot for myself, I didn't need to do that. <clears throat> right, so I guess we wait another another 12 turns and then... Um, it's now, yeah. Yep, won't be too long until that comes around. Okay, fantastic. Okay, I should, I should probably do something with my army. I need to fortify them in the cities. Alright, well now they're all fortified. <laughs> you know, I'm gonna put some musketmen in the uh, citadel. Near the capital, because why not? Yeah. Other than that, I'm pretty well guys, I can move all my forces around to each end of my controlled area if I really need to. Yeah. And I can do it pretty quickly actually. Since I've got so many roads put up, leading around. Mm. Right, another zoo, and I also have a caravel, which will come around in five turns. Okay, now oh great, got to a whole. New
Hmm. Sorry, I'm uh, debating what to um, trade of this guy. Ah, uh, those deals ended. Ah, uh, well. Still making plenty of gold, though. Pushing my trading a little bit here. All right, I've just offered a trade with you. Oh, ivory. Yeah, okay, I'll have that. Um, silver for citrus. Yeah, you know that, that that'll work. Hmm. Thank you. I got plenty of citrus. Is there anything to the north of your continent? <clears throat> oh, there's a city-state. The state. Uh, oh yeah, there is. Yeah, Bibelos, I forgot about that. I totally forgot about that city-state out there. I mean, it's like... <laughs> Almost invisible. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> it's right at the top where you wouldn't really expect to look for it. No. Oh, I found a new natural wonder as well. This is good. Only ten more turns till our World Congress. Oh, yeah, I'm looking forward to that. <laughs> Being the host isn't anything special, it just gives me one extra point. In reality, the biggest points you get is from having city states as allies. Ah, come on, ship, move. Uh, oh, I didn't realise it was. No, well, there we go. <clears throat> I nearly started a war with someone by mistake. <laughs> Who was that? Uh, I don't remember. I didn't really look. Um, okay, where's my ship? Caravan of four turns. Oh! Right. I'm gonna do this to for you out of pure friendom. Um, you're being planned against by the Portuguese. They're planning against you. Already? Hmm. Alright, I'm actually going to, to uh, do this to avoid this. I don't like wars, I don't want them getting powerful. So, here we go, let's declare that if either of us are attacked, we all attack others. Done deal. I don't want to be attacked, you don't want to be attacked. <laughs> I'm more powerful, money and happiness and all that, but you've probably got a bigger military than me. I haven't got any military really. <clears throat> oh, but they still I... wouldn't want to mess with me, I don't. <clears throat> Let's have a look at the point. Let's, have, let's uh, talk to my advisors and see. It doesn't. My advisor doesn't even mention anything about the Portuguese Empire. Really? Yeah. It, it does mention that your uh, that your military is quite lacking. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Although. Although it's still saying that, that saying that the Assyrian Empire is stronger than me, despite the fact that they're still using swordsmen. Yeah, they've probably just got big numbers. Yeah, probably. They wouldn't really be able to do too much against musketmen. Swords versus guns, I mean, come on. Guns win every time. Well. Uh, uh, not Nearly every time. Every Unless yeah, in like yeah, a really small corridor. <laughs> yeah, that's that's kind of what I was thinking. Unless you got like ninjas in the place. Yeah. 
Getting some culture in here. Oh, someone's entered the industrial era. That was Maria. I've already been entered the industrial era. I think I already have. <clears throat> I think I've been the first one to enter like every era so far. Yeah. I just discovered rifling, although some of my city state allies have already given me riflemen. as well. Yeah, happened yesterday though. Or the last time we recorded, which is like whenever that was. Yeah. Alright, that should be okay now. Yeah. De it definitely happened while you were trying to play online though. <laughs> yeah. Earlier on. That's because we had like eight <laughs> other people. Yeah, that After was. After this game, uh, we should try that. Um, play online of us too, because we should be able to technically join the same thing. Mm. I haven't even discovered cannons yet. That's quite embarrassing. I'm like discovering electricity, and I haven't even gone for a cannon yet. <laughs> I, I haven't got cannons. I'm not going. For <clears throat> well, I haven't said that. I'm not really going for ke uh, chemistry. <clears throat> so. Uh... I'm not making as much per turn as I was. Oh, Portugal are really starting to annoy me. They're becoming too powerful. I don't like that they settled on our island as well. Oh, I can still tech. Yeah. I hope you haven't spied on me. <laughs> I haven't spied on you. No, I can't remember. Let me just see. It'd be too awkward if you discovered me. That's Where? The biggest reasons. Um, hold on. Let me just let me just see where my spy currently is. It's currently in Portugal. <clears throat> so that that might be what they're pl planning against me because I've been stealing from. Oh dear. Every empire's got a more powerful, uh, powerful army than me. Embarrassing. <coughs> well, uh, an army isn't necessarily everything. I mean, you've got to remember that. Oh, crap, that had a camera. Get back that way. Alright, I'm out into the oceans. As soon as. The game Arrow works. Launches. <laughs> yeah. Right, I'll just plan my turn out ahead while I'm waiting. <clears throat> I will have a. I will have a windmill. Oh, cargo ship, bro, that needs to go out again. Um. You know, it can go out there. Go, my cargo ship. I've nearly uncovered the whole map now. It's just your island, which is mainly... I haven't explored the center of it. <laughs> well, you're still welcome to go in there, if you, if you want to. Oh, I plan to. Don't worry. I have my plans. I'm trying to not involve you too much, but undoubtedly it will probably end up involving you. Don't worry, I'm not going militaristic. It's nothing aggressive. <laughs> I don't have a big enough army to be aggressive. <laughs> uh, five turns. It's not a big deal, you just press the number counter. Very similar to how I voted myself into power. States, you're so greedy. <laughs> they all want you to be like 
They all want you to shower them in gold, otherwise, otherwise they don't like you. I wouldn't worry. I'm just going to shower them with more gold if you try. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm determined to be allied with every city state I find. Oh, I'm I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty um, showering them in gold. Yeah. I'm then... already allies with um, Budapest and uh, Byblos. I'm allies with Budapest, Byblos, Riga, Kiev. Uh, and that's all the ones uh, currently that I've discovered. You mean friends, because uh, you can only have one ally. Well, whatever, I'm friends with them all. Yeah, that's still good. They're all my friends. Okay, so I've I'll just poured a shit ton of gold into all of the sea states. And I'm now at maximum friendships with everybody. Yeah. <clears throat> so how much uh, how much gold do you got in your bank and how much are you make in a turn? 101 per turn and 1,651. I got 1,220, but I did have like 2,000. I'm currently making 114 a turn. Oh shit, I lost my ivory. How did I manage that? I must have accidentally traded it away. Whoops. <laughs> I really need ivory. <clears throat> I believe I have some ivory. What do you want for it? Hold on, let me just open up a thing with you. Um, well, I, I had ivory. Um... That's alright, I'll find this here if anybody asks us. Wait, hold on, what does it say? Uh, I don't have anything available to trade. I must be. I must have some deals going on. I must have given it away. <clears throat> Chances are, I'll probably have some more pretty soon. Wow, they really got to stop doing that. Fucking people spying on me. I hate that. That I, I can guarantee you, that's not me. I know it's not you. It tells me who it is. Okay, who's the uh... Ottomans? Oh, they're keeping a little eye on you, aren't they? Yeah, well, I'm now about to confront them about it. <laughs> <laughs> if the Portuguese confront me, I'm just going, ah, uh, whatever. I'll just go somewhere else. Hmm, I got. How much faith you got per turn? Just curious. Faith? 98. <coughs> How much? 98 faith per turn. Fucking hell, that's more than I thought. Blimey. How I much do you gain per turn? Uh, six. I have about 2024 faith spare. To buy with. I think you've worked out how I'm planning to win. <laughs> oh, I already, I already knew how you're gonna, how you plan to win. But I know that I can shut you down before, before that. Okay, it's on now. <laughs> Time well, for my not... Bible shield. Well, well, I'm gonna shut you down immediately. I, I, honestly, I'm gonna take out every other sieve before I get to you. <laughs> That's all right then. I'm gonna make sure every other sieve falls before I get to you. And they will fall. I have a sneaky little plan. It's a. <clears throat> I don't know if you'll appreciate it or not, but it's nothing directly involving you. Oh, what is your sneaky plan? Oh, I can't tell you. I'm going to leave that as a surprise for you and the viewers. Uh, it has to do with open borders, is it? No, nothing to do with open borders, I promise you. Hmm. I promise. I was thinking you were going to sneak profits through to the other, to get to the other sieves. No! I wouldn't do that. Yeah, fuck off, I know you will. <laughs> That's exactly the plan. Um, I'm going to convert all the sieves around you into uh, Protestantism. <laughs> and, um, and then I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to close up the uh, open borders and refuse to remove oh, them. didn't you know? Profits can go through borders. They don't count oh. as enemy units, so they can go through borders, whether it's open borders or not. <clears throat> well, if you'd like your profits to be dead, I suggest not sending them through. 
I'm not going to yours, I'm going to the other cities. <laughs> oh, yeah, but don't send them through my cities, otherwise they will die. I said that they wouldn't, didn't I? I know, I'm just, just, not just warning you. Just, just giving you a little warning. Do you really want me to send an army with my profits? <laughs> <laughs> do you really want to meet my army? Technically, we've got a declaration of friendship as well, so you can't do that anyway. Unless you want to upset every other civ. Oh, I'll just surround them with units and they can, they can just sit there. They won't be able to move. Then I'll be like, haha, screw you. <laughs> oh, I've got to wait for that bottle of water to melt a bit now. Oh, there's a bottle of ice at the minute. I haven't said that. Oh, I see. <clears throat> I see Portugal City. On your Which island. One? Oh, do you? Yeah, uh, Funchal, is it? Yeah, did you, uh, have you sailed over there now then? Yeah, uh, yeah, I'm like, I'm around the top of your island, I'm like, head down. You will see Paris. me then. I'm <clears> right next to them. You'll see why I'm annoyed that they're there now. God, these loadings are taking forever. Yeah, they are a little. It's like at the start of each turn, it just takes a moment. I just take the mm. time to plan out my move. <laughs> I think about what I'm going to do. Yeah. Bloody Portugal. Ooh, that Only is... one turn till the one con the World Congress. Oh great. <laughs> I'm definitely vote I'm definitely gonna vote against it. I'm not giving religious power to or such religious power to to someone that quickly. Hmm. Okay, so... I think they would win if that happened, actually. I'm not too sure. Right, so I just say nay, yeah? Yeah. Nay. Commit delegates. Nay, I say nay. Okay, let's see, let's get back to seriousness. There we go, oh like <laughs> You've still got barbarians. Yeah, do we? I didn't even notice. I I'm not joking, um just outside the border of Paris. There is a barbarian sitting there. <laughs> feel barbarian. free to uh, feel barbarian free to attack pikeman. it, it's never bothered me. <laughs> <laughs> barbarian pikeman. Hold on, I'll sort it out. Actually I'll just fuck it. Fuck it. Yeah, it's like <laughs> gonna die pretty soon. I'll probably just wipe it off the face of the planet and on the next turn. I'm quite, I'm quite surprised barbarians still exist. Hmm. Well, I haven't really worked that hard to get rid of them because they've never really caused a problem anymore. No, I, I kind of cleared them all out and just was done with it. I, mm. I can't stand them being around for too long. I mean. They're such a pain in the backside at the start of the game that I just <laughs> have to get rid of them. Huh, what should we do? Yeah, apparently the Ottoman Empire is, is a has a stronger military than me. Yeah, the Ottoman Empire's got a pretty powerful military. And the Assyrian army is now around the same strength as mine. So, so you're building up your military to fight them, are you? I haven't created a single military unit yet. 
I've literally Maybe just, they just spent less. Yeah, I, I've literally just sit, sat here upgrading some. <laughs> and I got I got musketmen, I got lancers, uh, crossbowmen, and uh, knights, and a couple of ships here and there. I mean, yeah. <laughs> I told you, everybody hates uh, France's idea. <laughs> oh, that went uh, that, that went down, did it? Oh yeah. And even better, my arts funding got up. And unlike France's selfish one, the arts funding helps everybody, not just me. No one likes selfishness. Exactly. You see, I could have been selfish. <laughs> only, only Portugal voted. What a surprise! Wow. Now she's like, oh, I have too many city states, so she wants to embargo city states, which means that nobody gets any gifts from city states, which is of course ridiculous. Uh, I missed that. Let's see what's... <clears throat> wow, okay, I... I, um... I rely quite heavily on, uh... <laughs> no. I rely quite, he quite heavily on, uh, trading with city states, so... Yeah. So how do you um create a resolution? Uh, I don't know. I think only. I think only uh, civs with certain power or something. I think it's only the first and second most powerful civ can uh, do it. Uh, where am I on the charts anyway? Uh, it should tell you if you click on the. Diplomacy, then World Congress, you can see everything. And next to your number, that'll tell you how powerful you are by number. Um, okay, so you're at 14. <laughs> She's at 3, I'm at 2, Ottomans are at 2, and Assyria's at 2. Hmm. The two proposals are embargo city states and enact world religion Protestantism. <laughs> well, I'm not enacting any world religion, so I don't I don't think any no. possible. I don't know if anyone would come on my side, I highly doubt it. No, I know who's gonna be against you. For sure. You? I know someone else is gonna be against you for sure. Maria? Oh yeah. Oh, and uh, the Ottomans, I, I'm i sure. Apart from... Only, I think... I don't know if the Ottomans would be happy or not if uh, it was Protestant, because nearly all their cities, apart from their capital, are Protestant. I mean, I wouldn't have thought they would be too happy about it. Hmm. <clears throat> I'd prefer it if the Assyrians were the first to fall. Yeah. I'm happy with you taking them over. Yeah, they, they, currently they, they may have a reasonable empire, but as far as I'm concerned, they're the weakest link. Yeah. Okay, the, the Ottoman Empire is now the same military strength, and so is the Assyrian. Nice. <laughs> My military is powerful. Oh. Well, when I say powerful, I mean it's not really, you know, <laughs> amazing. I'm getting a hundred faith per turn, though. A hundred? I'm now getting plus seven. Nice. <laughs> <clears throat> and I currently have a chance to have a um, great profit spawn. All right, yeah. That could before prove awkward to me. Oh, my my religion has a my religion is only present in one if in one of my cities. You don't really have much to worry about. Trust me. So as long as you're only converting your cities, I don't have a problem. Like I say, only one of my cities is converted. The other two aren't. <laughs> 
On the other hand, I've just converted nearly all of uh, Assyria to Protestantism. <clears throat> well, yeah, yeah, you know, you got about two cities left. Uh, how many cities have you got? One, two, three, four, five. Ah, I'm missing two. Yeah, you're right. I must have missed them. Mm -hmm. Silly me. Oh, some, I think someone just gave me a unit and I didn't... I didn't look to see what it was. It may have been another Lancer. Yeah. Either way. So you can get flights without electricity. That's interesting. Can you? Hmm, that's, that's quite interesting. <laughs> Our planes run. A bit on worried that you've power. got flight already, though. <laughs> no, I haven't got a flight. I was just looking for the technology tree. Ah. And apparently, apparently, you can get uh, flight without using um, your thing. Electricity. Which is interesting. Is certainly odd. I mean, like, what they, what they just like powered by pedal, <laughs> pedal power. <laughs> Man, you must have to pedal really fucking hard to get that thing up. I just got, just discovered a random city state in the middle of the ocean. That's pretty cool. Hmm, not bad. <clears throat> right, enhanced my religions. Oh, that's what you're doing with your thing. I didn't even know you hadn't got an enhanced religion already. Yep, that was my first one I've enhanced. Fair enough. How that's going to play out? Well, I don't quite know. In my capital city, there's like three followers of, so followers of something else. Eleven followers of my religion, uh, with 45 pressure to it. Yeah. In the other cities, it's not so strong, but hopefully by enhancing it, <coughs> things might get a bit better. I just got archaeology, which is kind of cool. Ah, I've recruited another spy. Wait, I think I just entered another era. Oh, really? Oh, I just entered the industrial era. Oh. Hmm, that's interesting. Didn't realise I'd fallen behind. Nonetheless, I seem to be uh, <coughs> moving at a reasonable pace. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Probably because probably my research took a slight detour. <coughs> I had to fill a few gaps in from parts yeah. that I'd missed. Okay, I also have another spy. Right, let's see. I think I'm gonna spy on the Assyrians again. They don't see Maria's plotting against you anymore. Well, that's good. Me and her are constantly conflicting, though. We keep building wonders 
which each other are trying to do, and stuff like that. Bad name. <sighs> I'm so glad we don't have to worry about barbarians anymore. <laughs> hmm, tell me about it. After that online match. Oh, I discovered the Great Barrier Reef. Oh, where is that? <clears throat> it is near Ankara. Where's Ankara? Like, uh, west of Istanbul. Okay. Cool. It's already the 1800s. We've gone through this quick. Yeah, the 1800s. I mean, we got <clears throat> we got until I can't I can't remember what the last date is. Mm. I so think it's 2050, I think. Something like that. <clears throat> I, I can't remember how many years it advances each time. Yeah. Go back that way. I think it might slow down the later it, it gets. I'm not entirely sure. Um. I don't know. <laughs> I discovered a barbarian encampment quite near you. <laughs> quite near me? Yeah, I didn't expect to be seeing. <clears throat> well, it must be pretty damn far out. Yeah. Will you allow me to travel a great profit through your lands? I promise I won't use them on any of your cities, but it's just a short cut to get to the other cities near you. Well, you don't spread any damn religion. Not to you. <laughs> yep. Just oh, sure. I certainly will be spreading religion, but not to you. <laughs> oh, I see, um, I see coal on that. Hooray for coal, there's like one deposit in outside my sea and I can't buy that damn tile. <laughs> I have to wait till my sea expands. Yeah. Golden Age time. Won't be long till I have my Golden Age either. Hold on. Oh yeah, there's coal within my within my borders. Thank God for that. Hmm. <clears throat> At least I can get some coal in there. I like coal. Coal, coal, coal. Hmm. So how? How happy are your peoples? 63 happy, that's how happy they are. Yeah, mine's at 20. Are you having glitches as well? Or at least loading problems? Yeah, yeah. Oh god, there's a uh, barbarian pirates sailing the seas. That's quite worrying. <laughs> they still exist. I don't want them taking my, uh, what's it called? 
cargo ship? Nah, I don't care about cargo ship much. My great profit. <laughs> what are they going to do with the profit? That's true. Say Nick, my great profit, I'll be unhappy. <laughs> <laughs> Eight turns till the World Congress. Yeah. Are you catching up to it, Maria, in terms of points? Oh! Open board has ended. That's not good. Let's have that again. Uh, I'm at 720. She's at like 1,023, so not necessarily catching up. Spying on Portugal. I was spying on Portugal. Do you mind uh, accepting or declining the trade offer I sent you? Very well. Hmm, the, the Ottomans have a great a, a, admiral. Oh, right, yeah. Hmm. I don't even know what they're used for. Well, that kind of a great general, except it's on the sea. For your ah. navy. Yeah, it's for your navy instead of your army. You can tell I don't really use navy stuff that often. <clears throat> well, I, yeah, I, I kind of figured the, the title admiral gave it away. Well, I, I guess that they are... Some sort of sea unit, but I didn't guess what they actually did. Yeah, pretty much just a great general for the sea. Yeah. Ah, oh, thanks for accepting. Right, once once I've got a little military weight a bit behind me, I'm gonna take out the Assyrians. Yeah, fair enough. Yeah, I just want a little bit more. Research and a bit more military weight behind me. Then I'll gladly walk in there and just wipe them out. Why? The Portuguese <clears throat> really do hate me. Oh, really? Oh, yes. How much do they hate you? They hate me as in they won't do any trades which are even slightly reasonable with me. <laughs> They don't actually hate me, they're neutral, but they I have a lot of negatives with them. Yeah, they're just sort of pushing their luck a little. Yeah. She's getting powerful though, she's catching up to me. <laughs> Maybe we'll have to shut her down. Yeah. I think that might be <clears throat> necessary. <throat> I think the best way to do it would be to get rid of Funchal. At least clear off that friggin' island. I mean, yeah. I mean, how, how, there's no possible way she can defend Funchal. I mean, she won't get she won't get units over there quick enough from the other side of the map. Yeah. Can probably take it before she even gets over there. Unfortunately, I'm not really a military person, but I won't exactly hide if you want to. Mm, I must admit, I'm quite tempted to send a few units over to wreck the place. Hmm. Hey, I got gold. Oh, I discovered another wonder. Nice. All right, I'm heading towards your country. Don't get alarmed. It's just my great profit. Uh, what city are you going to be arriving in? Uh, your cap. Capital. 
Yeah. Alright, I guess you're fairly close to arrival then, if you're going to be coming into my capsule. Mm. Oh, here we go, look. The session's upcoming. Five turns. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. <laughs> oh dear. Hmm, it's almost dented the Renaissance era. The Renaissance era? <laughs> oh, how behind are they? That is, that is Assyria. They are <laughs> awful. They are the worst team. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they're, I'm just going to wipe them out. Alright, you should see my Great Prophet now. Uh, hold on, I'm just moving my ships about. Boosh. And there we are. Next turn. Oh yeah, there you are. Oh, uh, the Portuguese army is currently marching a surprise attack against another civilization. We do not know which civ they are targeting. That's worrying. Well, they've been plotting against me, so it wouldn't surprise me if they tried coming over. Well, they changed that, unfortunately. <clears throat> I mean, I mean, not unfortunately, I mean, they changed that, so hopefully they're going to target somebody else. We have a defense agreement as well, so if they attack you, they'll be messing with me. And I hope the same, if they attack me, they'll be messing with you. Mm. Need my allies. We can't let each other go undefended. Not against the biggest power of all as uh, Portugal. Yeah, this is true. Neither of us are as powerful military as Portugal. Uh, do you mind just? Yeah, thanks. Yeah, I, I saw that. I'm just moving that away. Oh wow. <laughs> Uh, God, you have a lot of units. No. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> I, don't have, I don't have very many. You have a lot compared to mine. Trust me. Oh yeah, do some upgrading. I'm really worried about this embargo city states thing. If that fucking goes, if that yeah, happens, I'm worried because I trade a lot with city states. I'm gonna lose a lot of power. Yeah, if you're trading with city states, if that's where your money's <coughs> coming from, that's all gone, all of it. Yeah, I got I got six trade routes open with them. Yeah, you'll have to change all of them. <laughs> no thanks. Yeah, I I don't like the idea of that. I really, really don't. Of course, you've obviously got two negative proposals for you, don't you? Mm. You've either got to put all your things into not making the world Protestant, or you're going to lose all your city-state allies. I've obviously got 
my own issues as well, having the six state things or putting them all into religion. Yeah, lucky for me, I can just sort of flip, sort of put two and two in, and um, yeah. You'll keep us surrounding my uh, profit. Well, I didn't say it was going to be easy to get from my country, did I? Well, if it went, if I'd known it wasn't going to be easy, I wouldn't even bother. <laughs> Honestly, there'd be no actual point to using my great profit on your capital. Because the great profit doesn't work on a capital, because you can just born another profit in yourself and fucking get your religion back. Why do you think I haven't fully converted the guys from my neighbours yet? Uh -huh. Trust me, if you notice my great profit going south to your other cities, then feel free to stop him. But I'm just going to travel east to the other guys, the Assyrians. Oh, the Assyrians, I'll get, I'll get out of the way then. If you, if you just said you're going to these going to the Assyrians, I'll uh, just move out the way immediately. The only reason is because it takes a lot longer to go west um, from my sieve to... Oh, and by the way, you want to go a bit... If you go down south to Fez, along the road... I don't know where um, that is. I have a very blank map of what your sieve looks... Uh, your okay. island looks where, like. Where you are now, mm -hmm. go to the capital, and then, follow, uh, then keep following the road all the way down south till you get to Fez. And when you get to Fez, uh, if you go to the right, you'll see a... Well, no, sorry, not to the right. If you go straight down, you'll come to the end of the land, and you just go in the sea, go around the corner, and you're literally in their sea. Oh, okay. So you might as well just come all the way down the island, come off the other end, and, just, and then, then you'll go straight into their border. So I can't just go east, then? <clears throat> no, if you go east, you'll... you'll if, if you go east, you'll hit the... Um, a couple of city states, and you'll hit this. You'll hit the Assyrian city on the far side. But that's the longest way around. You might as well just take all my take the foot go down my road to the bomb, and I'll okay. um, I'll guide you on the way down. Thank you. Uh, it'll have to be next turn. I accidentally moved the prophet to the east. That's right. I wouldn't want to use my great prophet on your capital anyway, because if I started using him, surely you would probably attack him. Or something outrageous, mm -hmm. and I want to use all four of his uses, not just one of them. Oh, should have waited before I use that, but never mind. Right, in that case, I'll move some of these military units out of the way. So you can get down there. Alright, the path should be pretty clear for you now. Thank you! That makes my life easier. Thanks a lot. But, like I say, yeah, just follow the road. You shouldn't really go wrong anywhere. <clears throat> if you do, then there's something wrong. With you. <laughs> With me. Oh, I got a new, I got a new year from Budapest and didn't bother to see what the hell it was. So have a look. <clears throat> Anything obviously different? See, you wouldn't be getting those if they embargo it. At least I don't think they will. Oh, I got, a, I got a rifleman by the looks of it. Our defensive agreement is a. Uh... Yeah, just finished. Alright, so it's just safe, yeah? Yeah. <clears throat> just keep going safe and you should uh, get to it quite, quite easily. Cool. Oh, well, I'll just take a look at the map, make sure you're going the right way. <clears throat> ah, have you moved them already? Yeah, I just moved them to the west slightly. I'm going to head down your road. 
Yeah. Oh, there we go, assigned delegates. Ah, here it is. The awkward truth itself. Well, I'm going to nay everything, aren't I? I guess so. Your profit moves. Okay, you're heading in roughly the right direction. You just want to go. If you go to the right, like by a tile, you'll reach the road. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, so on the next turn, go go right a tile. You'll reach the road, and then you can just follow it. Cool. We'll have to try an online match after this. Yeah. Proper one. Oh, I'm bad with you say it's not fast. What? Oh, thank God. What about the religion? Uh, you load faster than me. Oh, I can't see it. <laughs> oh, it was passed. Uh, yes. Alright, I think it's invasion time. Tja! I hope you don't mean me. I don't actually know what world religion means, having the world religion. Does that mean everybody's there? <clears throat> My religion is still standing so far. Oh, okay. Um, designates a, a religion as the official world religion. Civilizations who have a majority of the cities in the empire following this religion get an additional two delegates. The religion spreads 25% faster and the holy city receives 50% tourism. There can only be one world religion at a time. So you say it's just south. Mm. I was going to say, I was, I was wondering if it meant um, like every city would turn into my religion. That, that's what I was thinking. But um, that I guess that'd be too OP. <laughs> ha! Assyria liked Protestantism idea. <laughs> they're the only other ones who voted for me. <laughs> Yeah, I find that a bit annoying. That's one. That's that's why they're gonna be the first ones destroyed. <clears throat> you may not even have a chance to kind of to turn their city before I claim it. I warn you, I'm gonna turn their cities either way, whether you own them or not. Hopefully, I'll get there <laughs> before that happens. Okay. Yeah, I've had enough of doing nothing. It's war time. Time to fight these bitches. Um, which means I'm going to need some units down south. Cool. 
Cor, your terrain is really rough. It's taking me ages to get down there. Oh yeah, it is. I might as well just travel by sea, to be honest. Yes, okay, the Assyrian army apparently looks lonely. <laughs> Prepare to get wrecked. Totally gonna take you out, totally gonna take you out. I'm going to do a trade with you. It's going to get you 25 gold per turn. It's a trade route. <clears throat> oh, that sounds right. Oh, a deal. What is oil actually worth? I don't really know. How much oil did it say I have in the trade? Uh, five, I think. Okay, so is that all the oil I have? How do I find out how much oil I have? Yeah, if you look at the top, it should say. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, I guess I could do with some extra luxury resources. I also don't want you to get too mad if I start spreading Protestantism to you, so I'm going to be trying to be as nice to you as I can. <laughs> well, you, you, you went off the tip a bit early there. Huh? You went off a bit early there. What do you mean? Uh, that's not the bottom, it was further down. You'd gone a bit too far west. Um, but you can... I'm just going to I'm just gonna sail to Assyria. Yeah, you I can be, see where he is on my side. Right. It's going to be a long, long way, probably, but... Your war face on your war face on. Right, I'd best not trade with Assyria anymore for good reasons. I'm probably gonna lose a bit of gold because um, I'm gonna cut off trading routes with them, but I'll regain it in the long run. Reformation belief, eh? Hmm, there's all I want to know. <clears throat> Alright. Where was I? Oh, yeah. About to get ready for war. Oh! You might want to be worried. Uh, Maria is plotting against you again. No, oh, really. Didn't want any. Distra I was kind of hoping to not have any distractions against this, but. Um, well, obviously, I'll help you if uh, you go to war. <clears throat> I keep getting gifted units by city states, so I should. I'm not the weak force I once was. I'm um, also, I don't know if you know this, but in the world, uh, what do you call it, thing, I've got a, 
a thing which um, basically is going to upgrade tax on um, military units, which means that uh, it's going to cost 25% more to have military units than before. Ah. It's up to you if you want to uh, support it or not, but... Did that oil help you in any way, by the way? Uh, it will do. But with, the way, but, but, but with the way you're screwing with military rules at the minute, that's not going to benefit me very much. Well, you know, why be able to bend the rules if you can't? You've got tons of money anyway, that shouldn't affect you too much. You're getting 71 gold per turn. Whilst she is getting minus 14 gold per turn. That will really screw her over. <clears throat> okay, personally, I don't think anyone's going to pass your little um, thing you've got going on. I wouldn't worry. You do realise that I have more votes than everybody else put together. Which is why my religion thing worked. Mm, having said that, there were those there were that voted with you, which was a foolish mistake for them. Only, what's his face? And he only put in one vote. It didn't make much difference. Hmm. Right, my army is mobilizing. Right, time to conquer Assyria. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take at least one C, at least. Sorry I'm taking so long, I had uh, other stuff to worry about. Mm -hmm. I'm a bit worried. This, uh, the Ottomans uh, keep having military units over my borders. <clears throat> Perhaps they know uh, you're, up to, you're up to something. I'm not up to something, though. I'm just playing the game as a pacifist. Never waged war, apart from that time with Venice. Oh, here comes a save. Ah. That's good timing, I guess. I 
I haven't done anything violent since my invasion of Venice very early in history. I have not built cities over other people's areas. All I do is peacefully trade and spread my lovely little religion. <laughs> and I haven't done anything violent more at all, really. Yeah, you keep going to war with, uh, what's it called, but that's fair enough, because they keep raising an army to you. Yeah, actually, I only went to war with them once, and that's because they started it. Oh, really? Yeah. It's so kind of like the Cold War, then, between you two. Yeah, pretty much. I haven't really done anything at all. I'm more of a pacifist you than you. Have you declared war now, though? Uh, no, not yet. Sorry, what was that? I said no, I haven't yet. Oh, uh, I meant before that. Oh, right, yeah. I'm more of a pacifist than you are. <laughs> what are your bonuses again? Um... Receives plus three gold and pl oh, never mind. Oh, did it just unload? Yeah. yeah. Here we go. It's unloaded for me now. Alright, so where am I going to go with this? <clears throat> oh yeah, I was going to evade, wasn't I? Time for invasion. Like I say, I'm going to take at least, at least, one C. Fair enough. Hopefully if one C falls... <clears throat> I'll, um... Yeah. Well, you know that oil I was crying about trading with you? Like, worried about trading with you? Hmm. I shouldn't have been too worried. Guess how much of it I've got? How much? 49. Wow. Ah, don't worry, don't worry it's going to be a victory or a loss, you son of a bitch. Huh? Uh, just this. I, 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 want, I want to tell me whether, I'm get, whether my chances of winning are high or whether they're low. Yeah. Um, oh, damn, I can see your that. army. Not... My great prophet is travelling by sea near it. <clears throat> um, I can't see your thing with G. Ah, uh, he's just off, um, he's just off, uh, Budapest, just south, in the sea. I got a great admiral. Hmm, not bad. I'm just going to station him as a... Defense thing. Right, time to fuck up his catapult. This means war. Shoot him. <laughs> shoot, shoot the damn thing. <sighs> Guess I'm going to get a little bit of lag here, aren't I? There we go, finally. and ready for war. <clears throat> it's gonna be a fight. Hmm, is that Colosseum in the war? That's interesting.
Hmm. How's your tourism now, by the way? Uh, tourism is a plus six. Yeah. Not amazing, but there you go. My great prophet will be weighed is in uh, Assyrian lands. Do not <clears throat> attack him. I may must ask kindly. <laughs> <laughs> well, it looks like the Assyrians are sending units across the water, which is one of the ways I can enter their borders. Oh, hello. What we got here? We've got a trebuchet. We've got knights, a um, couple of workers, and crossbowmen. Well, I'll just send. I know I'll, I know I'll beat them. Good old Gatlin gun over there will take out all of those. Excuse me, the Gatlin guns are pretty damn powerful. Oh yes, and a good uh, they're a good unit to have. So a musketman, to be quite honest. Hmm. Okay, you know things like lances I'm going to delete because. They're a bit old. Yeah, lances and knights. In theory, I don't need those anymore. No. Same for pikemen. I mean, a Gatling, Gatling guns and musketmen can handle anything they throw at me now. Yeah. So I won't be needing those. Um. All right, I'm all I'm good. <clears throat> I'm ready to rock and roll. Oh, really? You think you're gonna sneak around there, do you? I don't think your I don't think your tree your trireme is gonna get around there. I'm afraid to say, and you're not getting on that land either. So don't even think about it. My my warmongering. <laughs> what no? Ah oh, fuck! What's up? I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure that because I'm allied to you, your war has got me some bad points of my allies. Damn. Huh? Sweet. Indirect indirectly screwing you. Haha. -ha. That's mean, we're supposed to be allies. Haha. -ha. Indirectly I screwing. only had that because we're allies. Haha. -ha. <laughs> I didn't even have to attack you at screw you. <laughs> nice. <coughs> okay, so about half of the most of the Assyrian Assyrian uh, army is currently sitting in the water with nowhere to go but, except back to their own land um, <laughs> so I think I've got a pretty damn good ch chance here so I can't, I can't wait to get to the later stages where you get all the good technology all the, all the good stuff
Oh, yeah, a little. Ah, oh, this is one bars from there, can it? Hmm. Matters not. Say goodbye to your nights, mofo. Problem is, it's, like, it's quite a pinch, there's, there's a bit of a pinch point here, so I'm, <clears throat> I'm gonna have to beat their forces down before I can cross over. Yeah. And get to their city. Because their city can fire on me really, really. While I'm standing at the edge of the water. So I've got to. I've got to try and. Um, knock off some units before anything, before anything else. Yeah. Alright, City's Tower's got to go. Um, okay. Ooh, that will come in very, very handy. <coughs> I can possibly use that. No, oh, this great prophet's proving to be more effort than he's worth. <clears throat> yeah, he was that? Is he not doing as well as he thought? No, he's doing fine. It's just taking ages to get to the cities. <laughs> ah, you have pipe over there, do you? Ah, I'll soon get rid of that. They won't get on land. They'll never reach it. Yep, didn't think so. Oh, that's gonna have to go first. They, all the enemy units are coming through from the water, so it's just so easy to pick them off. Yeah. <clears throat> I can see they're coming up, actually, because I'm in his territory now. <clears throat> once, once I've worn them down enough, I can, I should be able to make a push. I just need to know when he's running out of units. I don't, don't know if you mind telling me when he's starting to run low. Yeah. I mean, I'd, I'd rather get this. I'd rather take at least one city without too much hassle. Yeah. Oh, I'd, I'd like at least one city without too much hassle. <clears throat> I 
Got a new unit from Budapest. Oh, I can see your units, look. Oh, right, hold on. Right near his city is a... Uh... Yeah, I've got a couple of bits and bobs that are coming up close. As expected, my gold took a bit of a hit. my gold uh, intake took a bit of a hit from the um, fact that I'm at war, but yeah, <clears throat> should be alright. Have a unit go. That's weird. How many trebuchets has this guy got? Like a bazillion. <laughs> Tell me about it. He's he's trying nothing but trebuchets. See your musketmen having a fun time with their pikemen. Yeah, Is that really an interesting that. spectacle to a random guy with a beard? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just insta healing most of my units. Yeah. <clears throat> and then going down, they're getting in the way. Well, thanks for killing them. It let oh, for fuck's sake, he's got more units wanting to come in. How annoying. I keep trying to get past, but he keeps sending more units to attack you. <laughs> yeah, he's got, he's got a fair few, I'll give him that. But I'm hoping, really hoping, that I can just force my way through. Yeah. If I can't, that's going to be a problem. If I can, then great. <clears throat> I discovered the Great Barrier Reef, finally. Yes, I can sneak around the back door. <laughs> Thanks for leaving that one open, sucker. And a couple of units round the back. Let's see if he likes that one. Yeah, yeah, you keep hitting my muskets. I will just switch them out my gatlings, heal them up, and then uh, Bob's your uncle, you're fucked. Well, not really fucked, but yeah, I'll keep doing that. <laughs> I'll just keep doing it and doing it and doing it. Switch, keep switching them around and Hopefully healing them. Oh look, an Assyrian crossbowman managed to get into my land. 
and now he's about to die. As soon as that lag stops, he'll be dead. Yep, there he goes. I shall allow the Syrians a Syrians passage for the moment, as I want to just use my religion on their cities, that is all. Looks <laughs> like a bar another capital. Like a... That was a siege tower. <laughs> Even better. <clears throat> the more the stupid units like take out, the better. <laughs> I'm going quite. It's going quite well at the moment. I think. I think. I, I think I'm at the point now where I can encircle their forces around one city and then uh, push push through from the back and just take them out. And then hopefully I can just walk into that city and take it. Yeah. Then I'll, then I'll um, seize it for my own. I see you're building an army. Uh, not particularly. I just keep giving gifted units. All the ones around. Uh... Paris are foreign legions, they were part of the uh, thing I uh, got as part of a bonus. Alright. I hate it when the screen does this. Yeah. Actually, I haven't built a single military unit since the takeover of Venice now that I think about it. Hmm. <sighs> they seem to be focusing all their fire on my um, riflemen. Yeah. I'd, I'd have thought they'd be more worried about my um, Gatling guns, if I'm honest. They obviously don't have a brain. I'm just going to go round the warfare. It's waiting for it, it's taking too long. Yeah, I'm going to set that one right there as well, I think. <laughs> what are you laughing at? <clears throat> Well, I'm about to steal a worker, so it doesn't run away back to the capital. Uh, back to its city, sorry, not capital. Capital, um... And if I, if I steal the worker, then that's great. If not, then I'm just going to wreck the crap out of all the units that are behind them. Yeah. Uh, they're in a sea. Oh, dude, my, uh, my religion's having an effect on, um, one of his cities. And it's, it's currently competing with yours. Though it's not very fairing... It's not very faring very well, but you know. I'm also fighting the Catholics. <clears throat> I'm pretty sure that I'm pretty sure someone's gonna start a war with you pretty soon. It's possible. Honestly, it wouldn't surprise me if someone did. No one, no one disliked me until you went to war. Yeah, this is true. Because all I kept doing was offering trades and stuff. I want that oil. Yeah. Mm. 
Alright, that's why they go for at me this time. The only one I'm worried about is uh, Portugal anyway. I have a bigger army than anybody else just by bloody gifting. I haven't had to spend a single penny yet on army. Apart mm. from maintenance. Maybe big, but how powerful is it? That's fairly powerful. Not enough to beat me, I wouldn't have thought. The advisors say so. Well, yeah, well, the advisors said that that the Assyrian army was more powerful than me, but look what's fucking happening. Yeah, <laughs> the Assyrians uh, are nothing. Hmm. Don't know. The advisors don't always don't always know what's going on. Whoops! I probably shouldn't have gone too close to that city. I probably should have gone a bit further around that side. <clears throat> it seems you see an army maybe slightly bigger than I figured. Still no major issue for me though. Ah oh, shit! What's up? I accidentally built an Inquisitor. <laughs> no matter, it's just annoying. Didn't need it for anything. I meant to get a, a missionary, that's it. I need to get rid of Catholicism. It's a problem. That's my first major target. Hmm, Ottomans have been spying on me. Bellens. <clears throat> you know what? Actually, I'm not going to take this laying down. Everybody's been treating me like shit. Fucking putting countries on my fucking doorstep and shit like that. That's not fair. Fucking trying to oust me of the city-state embargoes and stuff. I'm not going to take any more shit from Portugal. I'm taking back from Charles. Do it. Fucking mess with my army. I'll prove them who's the real fucking warlord <laughs> if I put my mind to it. I'm totally Fuck evading. you, France. No, I, I'm France. <laughs> Fuck you, Portugal. <laughs> oh. I'm sorry. Did that upset you, Maria? I'm sorry that we're at war now. I'm just gonna have to kill you, aren't I? Nobody declares war on me. That's just stupid. Except that guy. Well, he didn't actually declare war on me. I declared war on him. Alright, well, fair enough. Oh, uh, if you have to see this army moving towards him, he doesn't stand a chance. Wait, him? I thought it was a her. Her. <laughs> oh, yes! What are you guessing about? Army t army tax wasn't passed. I know. I helped negate it. I changed my mind. I like having an army now. I'm fed up of being peaceful. That's what I mean. Yes. And then that means it's also not, not going to affect me, which means also I can I can continue to fuck over the Assyrians without yes. having to worry about increased increased tax on my army. It's good for both of us. For once we agree. My advisor reckons I can crush the uh, 
Assyrian Empire. <clears throat> All they've got left is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven units left on the map that are on land and one in the water, which I can take out because I've got two. By the way, this is purely up to you. It wouldn't really matter either way. But um, I'm going to make it so Portugal can't trade with anybody. Because uh, fuck Portugal. I think I think I got quite... Yeah, I got, I got two trade routes with Portugal at the minute. You might want to change that then. Ah, oh, damn it. It won't be till 16 turns away anyway. Do you want to try it, Portugal? Do you really want to try it? <laughs> what, what are they jabbering on about? Oh, they're just getting ships around me. Their ships still have sails, so I'm laughing at them. Mm. <laughs> I'm, I'm guessing you're using ironclads. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's why I got ironclads. My army totally outguns them. Ridiculously so. They have nothing on me. Yeah, ain't got shit on you. I am the Napoleon. Our open borders has ended, although we weren't really using it anyway. No, not yet, anyways. Thank you, Bibolos. They just helped me attacking a Portuguese person. That's a shame. Portuguese, you really want to do that. You really want to try that. That is quite hilarious that you want to even attempt that. <laughs> what are they trying now? They're attacking a city state next to me. <clears throat> oh, that's interesting. Yeah, especially since I've completely outgunned them by a ridiculous amount. It uh, makes me laugh. They even took a uh, trade route from you. I know they did, bastards. It doesn't matter. It hasn't affected me that much. Sorry that my turns are taking exceptionally long. I'm sure you can guess why. Yeah, it might not, might not take very long because I've got very limited areas of attack. Or very limited routes of attack. I can only really fight one on one with only one, with only one unit until um, I wear the Assyrians down to the point where I can just flood units in. And, uh, I have a great general as well. Oh, sorry, yeah. Yeah, I've got a great general too. I'm not. I'm not risking him sending sending him into the battlefield at the minute, though. It's not just not worth it. Ha! <laughs> you didn't expect me to camp my missionary in Ally City State, did you? You, you thought you could have gummy on the sea just because it was a, a missionary. You think again.
Poor, poor Portugal. What are you going to do? <laughs> Can you actually watch me battling, or is that too far away for you to see? It depends on where, what, you're taking it back um, from Charles, aren't you? Um, At the moment, I don't plan on stopping after I beat that, though. i got an army, why waste it? I'm going to be taking all of Portugal. Mm, fair enough. Yeah, I'm in the modern era. That, uh, I think I got that a little while ago. Whoa, that's a bit weird. Bit of a number on that one. <clears throat> bit of a number. What do you mean by that? Oh, uh, they took out. Well, they they they've need to take one of my Gatling guns. Ah. Bear in mind that's the first unit they've taken out this entire invasion. Their capsule's not particularly powerful, is it? Um, not really. Not 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 compared to mine, anyway. Wow. Whammed. Did the game just crash for you? Uh, no. Save it quick. I, if I had the option to, it'll probably tell me in a minute that I'm like, uh... The host. Really, yeah, I'm the last human player, so I'll just, um... You want me to save it, yeah? Yeah, please. I need to join your game. Alright, that should have saved it. Do you want to stop recording whilst we set this up? Oh, uh, yeah, sure. Okay, so I guess we'll go from... Yeah, we'll... yeah. I guess we'll be back in a moment just in the next part once we fix this problem. So we'll be right back.